Good morning people and welcome back to my channel. It's China Doll here. So I'm doing a little staycation here at Pornofino Bay in Universal. It's a hotel that I've always wanted to stay at. Like I've hung out here a bunch of times, but you know, it's being here, being like actually staying over the night. I wanted to see the experience and then show you guys what they have here to offer and stuff like that. So let's go. You're parking your car here just to let you know it's $28 a night and they, your room key is the thing you use to get into the parking it also is for you can use it for express passes just not Hagrid's and you get um, one hour early access before the parks open by staying here at the night so right now I am gonna go through the lobby and show you um, what it's like and where you check in so there we go we're gonna go walk right through the lobby um, when you first walk through the lobby, them do, they do check your temperature and then they give you a wrist green band and if you have this, you, they don't have to check it again. They know that you know, you're good to go. But if, you, if it's your first time coming in, then they have to check your temperature right through here. Morning. I already... Oh, the different one? But this right hand side area is where you can check in right over here. And I forgot that every time you walk, every day it's a different color band, so that's why I have a purple one, but yesterday was my green band. Oh. Wow, this is so really nice. They have a little water fountain right in the main lobby area. And then over here is their concierge. And there's a bunch of signs in case you don't know where to go. So it tells you. And then um, they have a map of the whole property. In case you get lost, it tells you like where all the restaurants are rooms and stuff like that let's go down this hallway and see what they have over here they have a little gift shop on the left hand side oh, i really like the theming of this hotel because it reminds me of italy so i mean i've never been there and i, I know i travel a lot but this is like one place i don't know it's just so cool i can't i don't know you just have to look around but oh yeah. see there goes the italian flag a whole bunch of hallways in here and then in this section is where they have meeting rooms and ballrooms that's why it's pretty empty chandelier I am staying in the west wing on the second floor and I'm gonna give you guys a quick room tour so this is my room you just take your key come in whoa so when you first come in Ouch. So you have your little coffee maker, the cure of coffee. They give you a little bottle of hand sanitizer. See, this little perfume on it. Some water bottles. And then we walk into the bathroom. It's very spacious. It has double sinks right there. And there's me. And then this is the tub. The shower. And then in this closet over here, they have a safe, a blow dryer, and this is the bed. Very nice. TV. And a little refrigerator in here. And lots of storage. Yeah. A little desk you can do some work in couch and let's see what view I have outside well oh, it's just a pool view nothing too fancy but overall this room is really nice I like it first time staying in this resort 
I've always wanted to stay at this hotel because I've like hung out here a couple times, but I never actually stayed the night. So I'm really excited. Because the last time I stayed at Universal Hotel was at Cabana Bay last year, but yeah. I really like this painting over here. It says the painting by Studio Lucifer of Rome represents the fishing harbor of Porlefino in the early 19th century. I have some restrooms on this corner. And I'm gonna walk down this hallway and see what else do they have over here. So I just came out on the back side of the hotel and they have this big huge garden section here. I'm pretty sure this is where a lot of people have weddings and stuff like that. That's why it's such a big open spaced area. It's really nice. This is one of the pools that they have here. I think they have two pools here. So this is one of the, their pools with the little waterfall. Um, let's go downstairs to get a closer look of it. And they have cabanas here. I think you can rent them out. says pool hours are from 6 30 a.m. to 11 o'clock pull knob and left to enter that's what I just did so I'm guessing the pool area is locked so I couldn't get in so I'm gonna explore the rest of this resort so far, let's walk up these stairs and see where it goes so we're walking down the stairs right now and I'm gonna show you some of the restaurants and shops they have around here so I guess I'll start on the left hand side and show you what they have so one of the restaurants they have right here is called the Trattoria del Porto oh, in case you're wondering what they have here is like um but they have breakfast food and they have salads and salmon and chicken and shrimp alfredo, things like that. Then, let's see. now walking into the harbor area, this is a section that they have all the boats on the water. It's a really nice view. And they, like where my room was, my room is on that side, that building on the right hand side, the, the west wing. And you can also take a boat to get to Universal or you can take the buses to get there for transportation. But also, if you need to get your coffee fix, they have a Starbucks here. <laughs> which is on the left hand side and they also have a universal store so whatever merchandise that you don't get inside the parks you can just get it right here at your resort so it's very convenient so let's go in and see what we have and they have an ice cream shop right here called Gelatari Gelatari let's go into the universal store Today. Good, how are you? Hello. So they have this, like I said, the same kind of merch you can get into the parks and like hats and shirts and plushes and all the Harry Potter stuff. Really cool. Oh, there's my team, my house on it. Gryffindor. Um, you can get wands. And like 
full necessary reason. Mm. One thing to note, they have a bunch of hand sanitizers all throughout the resort. So you can use. So that's basically mainly the um most of the things you can do here at Portofino. So like I said, they have a bunch of restaurants and um shops and different you know ports of transportation to get to the parks or if you want you can drive there but i'm gonna take the water taxi today which is the boat to get to the parks i'm gonna give you guys a 360 view of this whole resort from where i'm standing so like i said that building over there is where my room was and this is the whole property of Portofino Bay. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention one more thing. There's a really good pizza spot, which is in that corner where that yellow building is. I ate there last time I came here, not when I stayed in that, but like, I just was like doing resort hopping and they have really good pizza in that spot right there. So this is where you go to to take the water taxi to head to city walk to go into universal but first you have to go through a metal detector line and when you get onto the boat they'll tell you what seat row number to get to sit in for Mardi Gras and I'm excited to try all the foodie stuff that I didn't have time on the first day I was here. I'm very excited and maybe go to islands later and go on Hagrid's if I can and the whole because I haven't rode that coast in a long time. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this little hotel tour. If you do, give me a thumbs up, like, comment, share, subscribe and I'll see you on the next video.